Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the incorrect parameter error you might be experiencing on your Windows device. So this is a DirectX error and we're going to just jump right into a resolution that should work for most of you guys. So without further delay we're going to open up a web browser. I'm going to open up Microsoft Edge but you can download this through whatever application you want and we're going to Google DirectX Runtime Web Installer and I'm going to hit enter to search it up and one of the best managers that comes up should be a Microsoft domain that says download DirectX and Runtime Web Installer I'm going to just click on that and you can also navigate to this by just going to the Microsoft web domain and then just go underneath searchmicrosoft.com and just type in what we just looked up on Google just now and without even really scrolling down there should be something that says DirectX and user runtime web installer underneath select language make sure that's correct and then you can select the download button right here I'm gonna uncheck the box to change our homepage to MSN you're welcome to keep that checked if you want I personally don't think it's necessary for this video and I'm gonna select no thanks and continue to continue the download right down here and it should take a couple seconds to download the file it's going to ask us what you want to do with it I'm going to save it at first and then I'm going to run the file if you receive a user account control window you want to select yes and during this time I'm going to close out of the web browser because it is no longer necessary for this tutorial so there should be a new window that comes up that says welcome to set up for DirectX you want to accept this agreement by clicking inside of the circle after you've looked through the end user license agreement and then you want to select next I'm going to uncheck the box that says install the Bing bar you can keep it checked if you want but personally I'm going to uncheck it for the same reasons I mentioned earlier and I'm going to select next again it's going to say installing components and then we're going to select next one more time and now it's going to begin to download and install Microsoft Direct X And there you go, you click on finish. I'd recommend restarting your computer and your error should be cleared up. So I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.